Exercises Question 1 Make a comparison and write down ways in which plant cells are different from animal cells. Answer Future of plant cell Cell wall is present. Chloroplasts is present for photosynthesis. One large central vacuole. Usually rectangular or boxed shape, centroids is absent in most plant cells. Future of animal cell Cell wall is absent. Chloroplasts is absent. Many small vacuoles. Shape is usually round or irregular. Centroids is present. Question 2. How is a prokaryotic cell different from a eukaryotic cell? Answer. Future of prokaryotic cell. Nucleus is not well defined. No nuclear membrane. Size is smaller. Membrane bound organelles is absent. DNA form is circular. Future of eukaryotic cell. Nucleus is well defined with nuclear membrane. Size is larger. Membrane bound organelles is present. DNA form is linear. Question 3. What would happen if the plasma membrane ruptures or breaks down? Answer: The cell would lose its contents as the plasma membrane maintains its internal environment. Without it, essential substances would leak out and harmful substances could enter causing cell death. Question 4. What would happen to the life of a cell if there was no Golgi apparatus? Answer: The Golgi apparatus processes and packages proteins and lipids. Without it, the cell would not be able to secrete or transport these materials properly, disrupting many cellular functions. Question 5. Which organelle is known as the powerhouse of the cell? Why? Answer. Mitochondria. Because they produce energy in the form of ATP during respiration. Question 6. Where do the lipids and proteins constituting the cell membrane get synthesized? Answer. Proteins are synthesized by ribosomes on the rough endoplasmic reticulum RER. Lipids are synthesized in the smooth endoplasmic reticulum SER. Question 7. How does an amoeba obtain its food? Answer. Amoeba engulfs food through phagocytosis by forming pseudopodia around it, enclosing the food in a food vacuum. Question 8. What is osmosis? Answer. Osmosis is the movement of water molecules from a region of higher water concentration to lower water concentration through a selectively permeable membrane. Question 9. Carry out the following osmosis experiment. Take four peeled potato halves and scoops each one out to make potato cups. One of these potato cups should be made from a boiled potato. Put each potato cup in a trough containing water. Now, Keep cup A empty, put 1 teaspoon sugar in cup B, put 1 teaspoon salt in cup C, put 1 teaspoon sugar in the boiled potato cup D. Keep these for 2 hours, then observe the 4 potato cups and answer the following. Explain why water gathers in the hollowed portion of B and C. Answer: Water moves into these cups by osmosis since the sugar or salt solution is more concentrated than the surrounding water. Why is potato A necessary for this experiment? Answer: Cup A is a control to compare results and show that no water movement happens without a solute. Explain why water does not gather in the hollowed out portion of A and D. Answer: Boiling kills the cells and denatures proteins, making the membrane non-selectively permeable, thus osmosis cannot occur. Question 10. Which type of cell division is required for growth and repair of body and which type is involved in formation of gametes? Answer. Mitosis is responsible for growth and repair. Meiosis is responsible for the formation of gametes. Thank you for watching. Please like, share and don't forget to subscribe our Get Skill Up channel for more educational info.